Hey guys, this is going to be my night routine of how I get little Miss Sutton ready for bed. I'm just showing you what I have for her while she's, what I need to get her ready for bed. And I give her a bath, so here's her towel. And a fresh diaper, white uh, powder, uh, hair care, her bottle that needs formula, uh, her brush and comb to brush her hair, and the most essential item for, in my opinion, the Victoria kit, because her hands are wide, and they're so flexible that I feel it's way too easy to rub paint off. So, she wears mittens every time she gets dressed. She may not stay in them, but every time we get dressed, it's just a little less fear on my part. But, I'm going to go ahead and bathe her, and since I can't really bathe her and let you see right now, I'll be back. Okay, so we all took our bath. We all, she took her bath. I'm just going to gently dab her down. I don't want to rub, I don't want to rub the paint off. So just gently dab her down. And I will not show girl parts because I do not want to get flagged, but if there accidentally is girl parts, girl girl parts, I mean I know her top showing, but then I'm just going to go ahead and let you know there may possibly be girl parts. I'm just going to dry in her ears. And I do occasionally take her earrings out and clean them, but they're never really, they don't get dirty, they're not like people earrings, I mean, then there she is from her little bath and I'm gonna go ahead and put a dapper on her just so we can cover up her bits okay there we go and I'm going to powder her and I like to put a lot or a good amount of powder in her joints because it helps them move much easier I don't put a lot in there I just put it on the on the seam and then just rub the rest of it and I'm careful I do have quite long nails just got powder in them but uh, I'm very careful not to scratch her because she does have a few little scratch marks from me not being careful but we do our very best to not do that and I already did her legs and I do her face but I like to pour it into my hand just a little bit. Because she has a very creasy face and it gets into her eyes and it's really hard to clean out of her eyes and her ears and so I just sometimes I give her a good one, but sometimes I Okay. Let's go ahead and do her back. And I always give her her pacifier because she is always grouchy. She's always a little grouchy. She never wants her bottle, but she's always a little grouchy. Look at her little, her little mole. But I already got her legs. I don't like her being too white, but you see right here, she had some, when I bought her, they were like that. And it just, it's two little rough spots that keep the powder in. I don't know, like maybe somebody tried to scrub something off of her, I don't know. My artist is not a bad artist, the one that I got both my dolls from, but I feel like they're new to a point. Their rooting is phenomenal, but, okay. Throw you over. Oh, she's a little pig with that little pig nose, huh? I'm gonna go ahead and, I'm not gonna put any conditioner on her hair because it is already wet and her hair is very easy to to work with you just gotta brush it out let's do the other side there it doesn't take long does it and every once in a while I change out her little pigtails, but I try not to do that as much because I feel like the little hair grips take out a lot of hair, even though they take like four strands out. Okay, so, mitts. 
the most important part of this night routine. The most important part of this night routine is these right here because she may very well cut her I mean take the cut the paint off sorry I'm tongue tied take the paint off so I'm gonna go ahead and dress her and it's gonna be really hard to do one handed so if I can't find anything I'll just uh go ahead and get her dressed also socks uh, same as the fingertips I always dress her in socks if you can't see your feet I always dress her in socks because I don't want the paint to come off and I've had her for seven months she hasn't lost you can see it uh, it's not up there she hasn't lost any of her tipping but she has lost tipping on her fingers so but I'm very cautious now Here's her little sockies, and I think these are six month size, but I just go ahead and roll them up there, and then you don't see them on her sleeper, and then you don't have to worry about her toes getting chipped. And there she is, all ready for bed. You can see she's got a lot of powder in her nose, but we're going to have a little play, and then we are going to take a bottle and go in at night. She's pretty good with her bottle. She'll take it and she'll go right on to sleep after it and she always wants to grab her toes or grab her her little wubba nub we don't really have a name for it right now uh, I know people all have little special names for their little snuggies but nope not this one huh I do find the wubba nub it stays secure but see it just comes out See if I can do this without. Let's lay her down and see if I can put this back in there. Because I cut her mouth, you can see. Ah! This is normally hard, easier with uh, two hands, and I probably should have just went ahead and did that with two hands, but I started, so sorry about that. Hold on, let me try and fix this. There we go. I think she was being a little bit camera shy. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, see, she gets powder right in her nose right there. Okay, so, I thought we had a bib. I guess not. Oh, well, we'll go get you another bib. And there it is, right there. So here's a little bit more we're going to make our bottle and we're going to go to Piggy Buys. I'm sorry this is such a long video, but I'm still new at this, so there we go. Just keep spitting it out. Hmm. There she goes. She's drank most of it, but it's a little early. She started getting tired and cranky, so thought maybe we'd give her a little bottle to see if she can hold her down. She'll she'll sleep a good seven seven hours just on this because she already ate just a little earlier. You done? Okay. And we're just gonna sit and play and kind of wait till nap till bedtime. She doesn't know the word bedtime yet, so. We can say it, but bye-bye. Thank you for watching. Sorry it was so long.